in 2016, comedian Keith Robinson had a stroke. Four years later, he suffered a second one. However, he is not letting it keep him away from the comedy stage. Instead, he is embracing his condition and putting it in his comedy act. You know, my biggest challenge, me and handicap, my biggest challenge, man, is crossing that long <laughs> street <laughs> with the light that has a countdown on it. <laughs> 14 seconds, what the <laughs> Don't you have a handicap two minutes? <laughs> <laughs> Veteran stand-up has a new Netflix special, Keith Robinson, Different Strokes, which just dropped yesterday and this morning. He is here live in the studio. So great to have you here, Keith. Thank you for hey, being man. here. Hey, man. Good to How's see you. How's it going? You Pretty know, good. you have such an unbelievable story, right? And so, first of all, I'm glad you're here. You're glad you're doing well. Two strokes, though. When you had the first one, what went through your mind? And then a second one. What went through my mind is like, this one wasn't that great. I wonder what a second one, you know. <laughs> now, the first one was, you know, it was easier, mm -hmm. actually. Mm. I was back up and running yeah. in two months. Wow. wow. Back on the stage performing. Yeah. And then I called Wanda Sykes and said, I'm ready to go on the road again. And then we're on the road. All city after city. Mm -hmm. So I was back up and running so fast. Yeah. I'm like, I did it. Right. And then the second one hit. Wow. I did it. Mm. I was gone for two years. Wow. My voice was, it's still a little shaky, mm -hmm. but it was non existent mm -hmm. for almost two years. Holy cow. So. I had to get a special contraption. I forget what they call it, to put in the mouth. You know what I mean? And it helped out. It helped out more with the yeah. confidence. Yeah, yeah. Because a lot of things is mental. Yeah. So I had the confidence to just keep going. Yeah. You know, so and that's how I, and I started getting back on stage after two years from there. Went down to the cellar, and I went on stage. I was nervous because I didn't know how the voice was going to be. Right. Mm -hmm. And I and it went great for three minutes. And then again, once again, once again, once again, and then again, called Wanda up. Hey, I'm ready to go on the road again. Mm -hmm. Back on the road. Mm -hmm. And that's that. Wow. Well, I got to see you in action at one of your shows, and I don't think I've ever laughed so hard. I was nearly, I mean, I was literally in tears laughing so hard. So yeah. it was really great to see you. Did you ever lose any confidence at all? For being on stage? Yeah. Yes, you do, in your mind, and, and, and you know, when you're at home sitting there, like, can I, am I vo is my voice gonna come back? Mm -hmm. And that's where I got one of the jokes. When I go to the, um, drive through and they they can't understand what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. I'm like, wait a minute. You sell nothing but chicken. <laughs> Guess what I want? <laughs> I, uh, I'm sorry, I don't understand. I'm sorry. You have nothing you have a, nothing but chicken on your menu. Right. Do you find though that some people in your audience are almost afraid to laugh because you're very self-deprecating in some, some of your comedy. Yes, I have to be. Yeah. You know what I do it all on purpose? Because I don't want people looking at me like, oh. Mm -hmm. Right. Oh. Yeah, look at him. He's trying. Yeah. No. Yeah. So I got to let him know I'm still the same idiot I was. Right. Before the stroke. Right. You'll be self-deprecating before. Yeah. You'll be self-deprecating <laughs> after, right? So you, you go with the title, Different Strokes. Were there ever were there other titles in the running? Why did you decide to land on, on different strokes? Oh, well, the first title was like uh, Stroke of Genius. <laughs> oh. But I like different strokes because I had two different strokes. Yeah. And they were very different. You know, the first one was I'm in I'm in a hospital. 
I had everybody come to see me. Mm -hmm. Kevin, Bill Burr, uh, Amy, Wanda Sykes. Mm -hmm. Everybody was just coming to see me. I had yeah. a good time. Yeah. In the hospital with my stroke. On. I was a celebrity. Mm -hmm. The second stroke was during a pandemic. Mm. So nobody had come to see him. Right. It was just me and the nurses. Right. And, you know, they didn't care. They could care less. Were you trying to make jokes to them? Yeah, they didn't. Well, they couldn't understand them, first of all. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, it was. Yeah. That, that was rough. And that's why I was so rough. Yeah. And I actually got COVID oh. in um, the hospital. Right. Yeah. And that was the worst. It was like wow. And they took you like to the in a dungeon. Yeah. yeah. They would circle around. Then you go to the special COVID section. Oh. And they lock you in the door. And I'm like, huh? And nobody wanted to really mess with you because nobody knew. Was. Yeah. What COVID won. Real quick, before we let you go, I want to be able to talk about your special, how excited you are to have it on. Uh, I, it's great. For, for that journey, the hospital and this journey, that you're actually on TV. Mm -hmm. And some of the nurses are actually going to see me on TV. And that, <laughs> now, but that's great to, to know that Different Strokes is on Netflix. Mm -hmm. And it's like, well, it's a great you. thing. Full circle moment. Hey, we're great to have you here. Come on back, okay? Exactly. I like that. Full Come circle. back. I'm coming back. Come you will be. Anytime. In an hour. An hour? Yeah. Here? Hey. Come can back do an and hour. with us. You could do the full hour with us. Uh, yeah. The full hour. I'm Let's eating, do it. I mean, chicken and then. <laughs> <laughs> We'd love it. Well, thanks a lot. I appreciate Keith, it. Good to see you, Keith. Thank you.